Hey, how's it going everyone? Uh, Tang here and uh, today we're just going to be uh, going over the banners for uh, the next uh, half of the 3.1 banners. So, uh, Nilu's uh, character demo uh, just got out. I recommend you watch it. It's nice. It's elegant. It's uh, pretty uh, mellow. I don't know if it's convincing me to go get her. I think I'm pretty much going to be holding on uh, to all my resources until uh, the Dendro Archon comes out. She unfortunately has the, that position to where, you know, she's kind of put off to the side because, you know, Dendro Archon's coming. That's going to be hype. But also we got to take a look at all the other banners that are coming out. So <clears throat> as far as Nilu, if you got, you know, the pieces together to build her up, you got your Dendros, you're going to probably go for the Archon as well. You know, that'd probably be the one time you use her because she is specific to, a, you know, a type of uh, special kind of bloom first. So you're running Dendros and Hydros and that's about it. In terms of uh, Albedo, for obviously it's going to be Mono Geo, that type of thing, whether it's Ido or Noel. So it it's a piece that it, it takes a certain niche you know, for these characters. They have to work around a certain team in terms of synergies are concerned. But what's surprising is all the four stars. Now, I'm hearing a lot of uh, content creators talking about skipping this. And, you know, it's a pretty valid reason because most of us have uh, played through a good amount of the game. We already either A, are not interested in building these or got the four stars already. But... I would recommend taking a second look if you're low on pity and you need these four star characters. So low pity, need some constellations. This isn't a bad idea to get it. And if you get a five star, whether it's a miss or not, you're still pretty happy because you got set up for the next banner. So we got these two out of the way. Now let's go to the swords. I think this sword is primarily for health i think uh nilu is uh, all about the health and jade cutter is amazing uh sack bow is also really good it's absolutely bananas on uh, diona and certain bow uh, supports also the xyphos moonlight i think i take a look at this but this is going to be really good for shinobu so i would definitely take a look on that i have no idea about the catalyst though these two because Elemental Mastery is uh, starting to come in full view, th these might be better than they were previously, so it may not be a bad idea to not necessarily go for the banner, but, you know, gives you a second look at it. Though I've had my share of spears and rain slashers. Everybody has at least five of these slashers, so yeah, <laughs> take that as you will. But yeah, I think that's a pretty much it. In a nutshell, if you're new, you are low pity, I recommend trying to go for the Zhang Li and the beta because they are just absolutely amazing. If you get Barbara, you cry because the constellations are not really there. But uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much my assessment on the event wishes. And uh, yeah, I go recommend taking a look at the demo of uh, Nilu. And uh, with that, all out of the way. I will see you all in the next uh, live stream. Take care.